Welcome back, YouTube. Thanks for coming and checking out another Fat Guy Builds. Today, we're back here again with the 1999 Legacy Outback Wagon. And we're just going to do a plain and simple oil change. I'm going to show you how to do it step by step, so follow along and do this yourself. Don't pay anybody for this. This car is not worth a whole lot, so we're just using a standard cheap Fram PH3593A. Use a 17 millimeter socket and grab a drain pan of some sort and remove the oil drain plug right here. Drain the oil into your drain pan. Wait for it to stop dripping. Use an oil filter wrench of some sort. I like these things. And uh, break loose your oil filter. Remove it and let it drip into your drain pan. Wipe off the surface there. Get a little bit of oil. Put it on the seal here. And then just spin it on hand tight. Put the plug in now that it's done dripping. Wipe everything down. Under the hood, on the driver's side, you have the dipstick and the oil cap. Right now we're gonna take the oil cap out and uh, we're gonna fill this up and then we're gonna check it with the dipstick. Under the hood, on the driver's side, you have the dipstick and the oil cap. Right now we're gonna take the oil cap out and uh, we're gonna fill this up and then we're gonna check it with the dipstick. If you start with four and a half quarts, it will be with a dry oil filter. It will be in the middle pretty much. And then we'll go inside, start it, let it run for 15 seconds, then check the oil and top it off as needed. So you're just gonna start it. It's gonna suck oil, put it in the oil filter. The dipstick level is gonna drop, fill it up into the center of the dipstick high and low. There's two marks on it. Obviously the camera's not gonna pick it up, but you should be able to read it. If you can't read it, find someone else to read it. Thanks for coming and checking out another Fat Guy Builds. Hopefully you can just change your own oil now and not pay anybody. So check me out on Instagram, like, share, subscribe. Till next time, wrench on.